Phonemic awareness is the ability to hear and manipulate the smallest unit of sound in our language, the phoneme. When I can hear s, it makes it a lot easier to connect the sound to the letter S in order to read and write words. Phonemic awareness is critical for decoding and spelling. This is a really hot topic right now, and there's a lot of people making claims about how to do phonemic awareness or about doing tons and tons of phonemic awareness every single day. But there are three important things that we actually know from research. First, phonemic awareness is the most powerful when it's paired with letters. It's actually extremely important to use letters with phonemic awareness. For example, if you are asking children to isolate the first sound in the word boat, and children already know that the letter B spells B, ask them to write the letter too. So it doesn't necessarily mean that we always have to pair with letters, but oral only phonemic awareness isn't actually as effective as pairing with letters when we can. Second, we need to focus on blending words like hearing at and being able to say cat and segmenting words like hearing cat and being able to say at. Blending and segmenting are the actual skills of readers and writers. Finally, phonemic awareness is actually very powerful when it's short and intense. You'll hear people throwing around things like, oh, we need to do 15 minutes a day from kindergarten through fifth grade. Actually, even as far back as the National Reading Panel in 2000, phonemic awareness instruction was most powerful when it was less than 15 hours total across an entire school year. So when we think about it, that's actually not much time at all. And it's not a huge part of children's experience, but we do need it there. We need it to be intense and supportive at the right moment in children's experiences as reading, so they are most supported in learning how to segment and blend words to read and write.